Hey everybody, Cokeman5 here. So, um, I just got this game because I was bored and I felt like I could use some other things to record and apparently pressing my record key also started the game. You got right key. There seems to be some chest to open this way. But anyway, so this is a game where um you like start out in a very old style RPG. Okay, it's, it's a tutorial it looks like. And so it starts out really old style, then it gets newer and stuff, and I felt like this was a game that could satisfy my boredom for a little bit. Now this, this reminds me of Pokemon so far. Just the beginning. Because this, this is the only kind of like old, really old Game Boy games I've played was Pokemon. Is that a tree I can cut down? Um, so it ex you got smoother scrolling. We'll save you some headache. Ooh, cool. So yeah, you unlock um new features. Yay, a sword. I remember back in the days when you had swords in games. Ooh. Okay, looks like I hit Ender and I can cut things. And that's like Zelda. I never really played the old Zelda games. Oh, so yeah, I, ju I just picked this game up randomly. You got monsters, be careful, do not touch them. And... Oh, not... Ooh, music. Yeah! Evil Land Tune, top in the chart since 2000. We're in a desert. So this is a... They, they say it's a short game, or... They do say it's a short adventure, so I'm guessing, uh... That actually means the game is pretty short. So I don't know how long this series will be, but I got a star. Ooh, hidden stars. So this is Mario now, too? You got the card bat, a new card to play Double Twin. Not really sure what the objective is yet. Well, it is an RPG type thing, so I guess there's some sort of villain? It's not looking like it has a storyline. 16 colors display, oh my god, color. We are, we're actually updating this fast. This is a fast game, let's see. Um, was there something over here I missed? Yeah, I haven't actually checked what this is, have I? Game saved, okay, that's the save point. Okay, I'm gonna go... Wait, this is where I just added, I got the bat. So hopefully this series will be, uh... Good length. Or maybe not. That! These are octopus thingies. Um, RPGs I've never really played that many of. Like, I would start RPGs, but I just wouldn't finish them. I don't know what it is about RPGs. It's probably all the grinding that kind of makes me stop playing. But this doesn't look like it'll be. It'll be like that. Even then, oh. That was just an introduction type thing. After centuries of peace, an ancient evil has finally resurfaced. Like there is a story. To threaten the world of Evo Landia. You are one of the few remaining members of the Order of the Dragon Knights, whose purpose is to travel the world to help the needy and fight evil. Those centuries of peace clearly mean you haven't had a whole lot to do recently. But it looks like business is picking up again. Oh yeah. We're gonna go beat Ganondorf? You got the storyline! This plot is so deep and rich, yes. It does look very comfy. Ooh, 256 color display. Why does this to me actually feel worse? I like the old display. You got sign panel! You can read things. This path is reserved for agile adventures. Oh, can't make it to that save point yet. Ah, I feel like I like the other the, the other color display better. I don't know. Maybe, maybe I just like gold graphics. You got free movement. Looks like it's time for some action adventure. What does free movement mean? Oh. I guess it's not grid based? Was it grid based before? I didn't even notice. The access has been blocked by the dimensional stone. Try the path to the east. The east. The east is this way. I do not have sprint yet. I wonder if they're gonna add that. Sprint does sound like something... Like, I know most games have sprint. Nowadays, so... You got a star! Yay! Path to the east. How far east do I have to go? Do I have to go all the way back here? There's gotta be something about that rock. Maybe I can come back and break it in. Did I miss it? I'm kinda confused now. What does it mean my path to the east? There was no path to the east. Um, 
this. Oh, this opened up at some point. Game save. Oh, that's an enemy. Is it? Oh, there's supposed to be statues. The kind of statues that come alive and kill you in Zelda. Yeah, I hated them in Zelda. You got path or not. Killing all the monsters will sometimes help you in your quest. Yay! I got an inventory. Sword. Looks like we have bombs and arrows later. Two out of thirty stars. How do we open these things? How do I unblock the rocks? I guess you need bombs for them, probably. Overworld! Ooh. I can free explore in the overworld. Turn based battle. Ooh. Oh, wait. God damn it. It's one of those type of things where you don't actually see the monsters, but you just run into them randomly. Tech. It seems fun, but it looks like they could, uh, they could elongate it some more. They should come out with Evil Land too. Crisis. Dice slimes. Good old slimes. That's a big slime, though. It's like way bigger than me. What was that money, Jill? Got mode 7 in it. It looks really gorgeous when it was in shoes back in 1990. Three slimes. Gonna have some trouble here. Like, I think they should have a system where you like do quests to unlock the different features of these games. Where optionally you could like go through the entire game on with all the worst features ever. 150 gliss. He looked for hidden stars, but I also don't want to die from slimes. Ooh. Got place's name. You will learn the name of the places you chat. Oh, I missed the name though. It told me, but I missed it. So, no turn based combat here. Let's see. Oh, activate all your fuckers. Bring it on. Okay, you can't attack them from the front. Looks like they have shields. Oh, we should have noticed that earlier. Bad shields. You got chest unlock. Killing all the monsters can also unlock treasures. I got there's plenty of save points. That's one good thing. Village! Why do villages always have such annoying music? I don't think villages have annoying music. In fact, this, mu this music sounds pretty nice to me. I don't know why they would insult their own music. There's no annoying music here. Oh, that's how you leave the village. Papunika Village. Oh. They haven't added Sprint yet. I do like to Sprint. NPC! Sorry, I don't speak to you, dick. You'll see, I'll get the Master Sword and then you'll talk to me. Stop bothering me, go play with other children. Oh. One of the passageways always have to be blocked. Can we at least go inside? No. Maybe we'll unlock that. What are you doing here? Children should go to bed. But it's daytime! If you're not a nice boy, the evil Kefka's ghost will come and get you. Wow, these, these villagers are dicks! Just complete another dude. You got a secret place. What the hell are you doing in this place? You have found a strange seed. Do you want to eat it? Yeah, sure, why not? I can't see anything wrong with that. Fuck yeah, I found the Master Sword! The Master Seed. What's with all the kids in video games nowadays? I don't really, what is, what is up with that? When it comes to RPGs, the, the characters are always kids. You got the card worm, a new card to play Double Twin. What the hell is Double Twin? I don't know. Worm! Oop. Climb the room. Okay, so now I'm tall. I heard a lot of strange sounds coming out of the North Caves. A girl has visited us over here. Is she a friend of yours? I guess this is actually the future. Even more like the Master Sword. The Crystal Caves to the north are a dangerous place. It is said Kefka's ghost lives there. But no adventurer has ever come back to tell us. I like how they say that was a secret place, but then it's obvious that you couldn't continue until you found it. There are quite strong monsters in the caves ahead. We won't let you pass with your current equipment. Okay, we need to find equipment. We still can't go in the houses. 
Doesn't seem like it. Welcome to the Papunika village. Please enjoy your stay with us. I will, good sir. I will. Not as a child, though. Adults are not funny. They always complain about us children. Yeah, these adults are assholes, aren't they? If only I could eat the growth seed, I would no longer be a child. But the seed I found has fallen down the well. I am too scared to get it back. It's too dark out. See, how is that a secret if they tell you? And also, it looks like it's not the future. So, never mind about that. Yeah, 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 yeah. I can invite... In <laughs> invade houses. Is this is an inn. You got innkeeper. A nice bed is waiting for you at a decent price. You look tired, blah, blah, blah. Eh? Well, I guess I am kind of hurt. Decent press. Yes. What would happen if I just missed one of these chests? They probably just wouldn't let me continue until I found them all. What is here? Loot! I like loot. Shopkeeper! You can always spend your gems with this guy. Potion, long sword, phoenix down. Okay, that, that's just a complete ripoff from Final Fantasy. Rare card. Ooh, I do like rare card. How to get rare card. Okay, let's get a long sword. If I didn't freaking sleep, I could get the copper armor. Phoenix down. Oh, I can't really. Oh, I could buy a potion. I'll be back. I'm gonna get that rare card. That is not an exit. I could be. I can jump out the window. What's wrong with that? Already talked to that guy. Do I get to name my character at all? Actually, I kind of hope I don't, because I'm just so bad at coming up with the names. I got the torque card! And... Yeah, that's... Oh, do I have the equipment? We want... Oh, wait, we have a inventory. So, let's see, how do I work inventory? I don't use the cursor. How to inventory. This is not the inventory screen I had earlier, is it? No. No. How do I get the inventory I had before? Where I actually saw bombs, arrows, and sword. I don't know. Oh yeah, I have to go battle more. Oh yeah, I have to get that copper armor or something. Oh my god, it's a fucking giant chicken. Where were you in Minecraft earlier? Wow, okay. Pretty slow for a giant chicken. Maybe you can explore and find some secrets or something. Go all the way to the left here. Killing emucks the entire way. Can we check our items? Okay, I'm, I'm guessing the sword was auto avoided. So I am killing these guys quite fast. And if it didn't, well, well. There's gotta be something secret around here. What happened to all the slime? Oh, it's because I grew up. That explains it. So now there's only emucks. Emucks mucking around. Oh, I guess we are on our secrets. Oh, there's slimes still. Slimes and emucks. I am doing damage now, though. When do I get party members? When do I get special moves? When do I get lots of things? There's an item up above. Uh, is this the shop? Yeah, this is the shop. Bye. Copper armor. You got equipped. You are now ready to fight stronger monsters. Yay. I will be back for that rare card. You know what? I don't trust it. I do not trust it. Something will like happen to the village, and then I won't be able to buy it. Why else would they make it only cost 500? I'm gonna train here, and I'm gonna get stuff for them. I do like the attack system. That's that like time bar thing. I don't recall any other games having that. Instead of just having a speed stat, it actually will show when you can get an attack again. 
I like it. It's a cool system. 100 gliss. How much do I have? Should have enough soon. I'm getting a good amount of money from these dudes. Fifty gliss. Yeah, I can check. Five hundred forty. We have enough. Uh, then we'll go sleep in the end, because we do need health. You there? Rare card. E muck. Okay, so the cards represent the monsters, but I still don't know what this double twin is. I'm sure I'll find out. Maybe it's like a mini game or something you can do in here. Mini card game. Give me a second. 